am Liam Montier and this is Clipto, my favourite pocket mentalism effect. Three different coins are sealed into three envelopes, mixed up by the spectator, and I instantly reveal each location of each coin. Now keep this in mind, all of the envelopes are unmarked and ungaffed and you could even borrow them. The coins are all regular, you can replace them with coins from any currency that you like. There's no magnets, there's no markings, there's no moves, forces, slights or switches. There's also no technology to let you down in the heat of performance. You can also do Clipto completely blindfolded, you don't need to see a thing. Clipto is a mind-blowing effect with a totally foolproof method and it's a trick you're going to love. This is Clipto. So Rach, we're going to try an experiment in sort of divination. Oh, that kind okay. Of thing. All right, it doesn't always work. It's not uh, like a magic trick as such. Uh, it doesn't really have a method, but it does kind <laughs> of work. Okay. Weirdly, it works sometimes, oh. and when it does, it's quite unexplainable. Okay, okay. so we're going to just try and show you anyway. Um, so what I've got is I've got a few bits in this bag. I've got a pen uh, that I'm going to need in a moment, and then I've got three envelopes Ooh. and three coins in these little plastic um, things. Now, the uh, the reason the coins are in the little plastic holders, these are like um, holders that coin collectors uh, use, you know, ah, nerds use okay. to keep yeah, coins yeah. safe. Yeah. He says nerds, you know, I do card tricks for a living, so there's me <laughs> wailing on people that collect <laughs> coins. Um, but that's basically, the reason I've, I've done this and locked each one into a different um, little coin thing is you might think that I can somehow feel the size difference of the coins. Uh, Whereas, well, of course, yes. when they're locked in here, all of them True. are the same size, basically. Okay. I've also got three envelopes and I'd like you to examine those, make sure they're okay, make sure there's no markings on them or anything like sure, that. Yeah. Um, and okay. yeah, just make, just satisfy yourself that those are regulation envelopes. Yep. You happy with that? They look pretty normal to me. Excellent. So uh, hand me any one, it doesn't matter which one you hand me, and I'm going to show you what I'm going to have you do. I'm going to have you place the uh, coin inside, um, any coin in any envelope, and then actually seal the envelope up. Just like that. Okay. Okay, and okay. I'm going to have you do that with the others as well. So I'll turn away so I don't see which coin goes in which envelope. Right. Just drop one in, seal it up, chuck it on the pile, and do. <laughs> don't eat the envelope. <laughs> <laughs> they should flavour the stuff. That'd be a great idea. You see, I thought that. And Strawberry flavour. Mentioned it. They're done. Excellent. And then um, take them and yeah, give them a good shuffle yeah, away ahead of the game. Well, I don't want you to even know where your one was. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Excellent. <laughs> So the idea is, I'm going to try and tell, just get a sense of what coin is in which one. If I get any wrong, you can keep the money. It's only the dizzying Aww. amount of £1.21, so It'll it's do. not a huge amount. Yeah, but you know, times are hard. Yeah. So here we go. Oh, that was speedy. Yeah, don't hang about. Wow. I'll just go with my instincts. Like I say, it doesn't always work. Didn't even um, do any feely. No, didn't, no time for that. No time for that at all. <laughs> so let's see how we did. Remember, if we get any of these wrong, you keep the money that went wrong. Okay. Okay, so I said that this would be the penny. We're going to rip this open and inside the penny. We're off to a good start. We said the 20p here. Inside the 20p. And we said the pound here. Oh, how did you do that? The pound. Psychic, I honestly couldn't tell you. I think I might just be psychic. You didn't or even, lying. Didn't even weigh them or shake them. Yeah. I would have at least. <laughs> okay. There you go. 